By way of introduction, this video essay is about Miss Unseen, used in John Luke the Godard's bread list. Miss Unseen, as a word, was borrowed from a French theoretical expression, which means put into the sin. In other words, it means all that is put within a frame in a movie. It includes setting, lighting, costume, staging, makeup, and all other elements put together on screen. Fredless already challenged the accepted rules of cinematic language in the sequence near the opening of the film where Michael drives towards a police speed trap. He addresses the camera and hence the audience directly. Michael Pocat plays his role perfectly and he plays the role of a classic sexual magnetism. He plays a woman hunter, a ruthless dog who tries to be, be like Humphrey Bogart, kills for no reason and constantly bears different women, both for sheer pleasure and supposedly for love. He acts terribly, making the film resemble any American film, no film. He talks about love but cannot find it. Michael is an exceptional good actor and he did a good job thereby playing out his role in the film. Patricia Francini, on the other hand, is sweet looking, innocent and with no redirectional path in life. She is looking for something, what she does not know, but something she needs to obtain. Her internal uncertainty is as uncertain for her as it is for us, as we really did not know what she was seeking. She does not want to refuse Michael, yet she does not want to commit to him. We notice this sense of something missing in her life, which is obtainable in, in some female lives today, which makes the audience equally understand the film better. In many ways, the film Breathless can be seen as the first of Godard's increasingly ambiguous love letters to Hollywood cinema. He established this through the relationship between Michael and Patricia, a relationship marked by mutual incomprehension as the love affair between Michael and Patricia becomes fraught with mistrust, linguistic misunderstanding, and ultimately betrayal. This makes for a better understanding of what the film means and what it was set to achieve. In terms of setting, this film was shot in the streets of France, where the director already have access to. They shot in the streets without obtaining permission. That is, it was shot at locations and the director and actors were doing their things naturally. Before this time, movies were shot in constructed stages with constructed sets and specialized lighting. But this brought a change in the whole system in that they shot with natural light on the streets. Michelle's dressing resembles that of a gangster. He thinks of himself as a gangster and dresses the same. His suit and hat, coupled with sunglasses and the cigarettes always hanging out of his mouth, are props used to show the audience that Michelle is a typical gangster in the film. Patricia's sweet looking gowns and nice shoes, simple fine dresses, and always looking at the mirrors that are in the street and the kind of bag she carries and the pictures in her room and the walls of her rooms and her makeup kits all are pro. These are examples of misunderstanding in this film. Thanks for watching.